Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Pashpika. Welcome to Global Art Magazine Pay channel where we make content for artists and creative entrepreneurs. In today's video, guys, I'm going to show you how to upload your graphic, your illustration, or your digital artwork or digital art or design, whatever it is, on Creative Fabrica. How to upload onto the Creative Fabrica. I'm going to show you exactly step by step. How to upload it because it's so simple and so easy their user interface their website is so easy they just have the simple page a single page or you just need to upload your art that is in the form of a digital download or graphic illustrations or kdp interior whatever it is that is in the form of digital download you can sell on the creative fabrica you can upload it and i'm going to show you exactly step by step on how to do it so if you're interested in that then let's get started with that and before going into the good part guys please click on the like button i would really appreciate that now let's get started with the main part of the video guys so i'm going to hop up onto my laptop and i'm going to show you exactly how to do it so let's get started with that guys where you can add your different details related to the product and everything in depth so i'm just gonna add a new graphic over here so i'm just gonna uh, write the product name so i'm just uploading a small art printable so i'm just gonna write over here abstract since it's my abstract so abstract shapes art printable slash graphic it's an art printable as well it's a graphic as well so write a name of your product over here then choose the category which is really really important guys there are various categories related to your products you can choose the various different categories if you're uploading a photograph or you're uploading an abstract you can choose it according to it you just choose the illustrations and a product mockups if it's a product mockups or backgrounds graphic templates so since it's a print template, so I'm just going to click over to the print template. You can also put this a graphic as well. Now this is the price option guys. If you sell on the marketplace, enter the lowest selling price and to keep consistent pricing. So I'm just going to add a price according to it. I'm just adding $2.99. You can also offer this as a freebie guys. If you, if you are a new shop, if you have a new shop on Creative Fabrica, and you don't have a followers or you don't have favorites on your shop then i would really really recommend you to upload your product as a free product because as a freebie you're gonna get many followers you're gonna get a reviews for your product you're gonna get a favorites for your shop for your product which will really going to help you rank much higher onto the creative fabrica because you're offering a freebie and many people are looking coming onto the platform to actually download the freebies and if your product is there as a freebie, then it's more highly likely chances to get more eyeballs on your product and thereby getting more eyeballs on your shop. So it's really, really important. If you're a new shop, I would highly recommend starting with a freebie. In fact, for my shop as well, once in a while, I upload a uh, graphic or I upload a product or any digital download as a freebie because it's really, really important to get more eyeballs, to get more followers, more favorites, more reviews for your shop and so on. So I recommend this if you are a new shop and if you are not a new shop and you are just getting started with that or you have a kind of like good sales coming in, then also this is a thing that you can do it once in a while, maybe uh, once in two or three months or whatever suits to you, which is really, really important. Now I need to write the description of my product. So it's an abstract art printable. It's a graphic. It's uh, so I'm good, just going to write uh, related to the graphic. It's a high quality abstract shapes, abstract shapes uh, which you can use, which you can use for uh, for decorating your home or you can also use it for a uh, graphics graphic for your print on demand shops or for any other any other projects and so on and i'm gonna write this product contain uh two different sizes are there in different jpeg so two different sizes two different sizes in j 
jpeg format you can go and do that guys which contains jpeg format and i have the grammarly downloaded to check my grammar because i often make mistakes and then i can write the size that is the size is a2 a2 size another one is uh, 8 in 18 into 24 24 inches this is the size of my product it's come in two different sizes you can write it according to your product guys you can do that very well according to your product and then write a little bit more about what is the purpose of this and how you can use it you can simply you can simply download the file and can take a printout uh, print out at your home and can use it and can use it as a war art okay guys so this is a little bit description now you can elaborate the description and you can write much more things related to your description here I've just write, written a short description just this is just a test product guys I'm uploading this is just a test product for to, for to show you guys how to upload a graphic or how to upload a digital product onto the Creative Fabrica so this is just a small example now this is just the test product and you can very well go and write much more about the description of your product here guys and now I'm just gonna scroll down this is a product tag so maximum I can upload the 50 tags but before that i'm just going to upload the images um, here is the thumbnail that is a product image the recommended size is uh, five like your file should be at least 580 pixels into 386 pixels but it shouldn't be larger than 5000 into 5000 pixels so make your product image before only uh, before this going with this procedure so i have already have that so i'm just going to click over to drag and drop file here is a browse files Okay guys, I've selected the file. Now here is the product file. Now the product file should be in the zip format guys. You have like I am uploading the two JPEG files. So my JPEG files have already compressed into the zip file. Now there are many zip uh, files. Uh, there are many uh, websites out there which allow you to upload your artwork or which allow you to convert your uh, digital download or digital file into zip format you can those you can use those website to create a zip file for your uh, digital download but i have already done that so i'm just going to click over here so here my file and my product file is uploading till then i'm just going to go and write the product tag so i have like 50 tags now guys this is a visibility score you can use it for your advantage like if you're a new seller you need to have a visibility score high so that your product will be having a more likely chances to be found on the to creative fabrica thus getting more sales so you should have a unique product name product description is over 250 characters you need to have a product description product description over 250 characters then minimum three tags are required and three or more product images i'm just uploading a single one you can upload three or more depending on whatever it is so i'm just going to write the product tags over here that is the art Printables art prints high quality art print on demand POD graphic PD illustration all art no I'm just making this by mistake. now guys i have uploaded like i have added a few of the product tags you can very well go and add the maximum up to 50 tags like you are having a 50 tag slots you can use and very well use for it by the time since my file is uploading this one is already uploaded this one is 88 percent in supporting i'm just going to quote over here this is the consider as a freebie if selected your graphic will be freebie for the week and will be you will receive 20 dollars 
So if you want your files to be selected or your product to be selected as a freebie on the platform for a week, then you're going to receive a $20. So if you want your product to be considered as a freebie, click on this checkbox. And if you want your file or product to be considered for the bundles, they have the bundles and bundle sales well, so I'll probably just click on that. Consider for pick and mix. If you want your product to be selected as a pick and mix for the customers to create their own bundles so that they will purchase it. So just click on that. Consider for discount deals. If you want your uh, product to be considered for the discount deals they have on their marketplace like Valentine deals, uh, December deals, holiday deals and so on. I can very well select that because I want that. And then by ticking, the, uh, by ticking this box, I confirm that I can agree to designer terms and conditions. You can read the terms and conditions before clicking on this uh, checkbox. Very well read the terms and conditions, guys, which is really, really important. So please go through them and read the terms and conditions before actually uploading any artwork or any design or any graphics on the platform. And then click on the submit option, guys. That's it. Guys, now I'm not gonna submit this thing because this is the file I've just randomly uploaded just to show you guys and how to upload a graphic or how to upload an artwork or design onto the Creative Fabrica. This is just a simple page layout. It's quite simple. You just need to submit and then they're gonna review your product. And once your product has been reviewed, they're just gonna be live onto their marketplace and you can very well go onto your store and check that your product is live or not. This is as simple as easy. It's really, really simple, guys. You nothing need. That means you nothing need to go into much complication or anything like that. Once you click onto the submit option, your file will gonna be reviewed. They'll gonna review your file. They're gonna review your graphics. And once they approve it, then your graphic, your digital download will be live on the platform. And you can very well go onto your own store and check for this product and all that. So this is a simple way to just to upload onto the Creative Fabrica. It's quite simple and quite easy, guys. Everyone can do it. It's quite easy. But so I hope you enjoyed today's video. It was useful to you. Leave a comment below and let me know are you currently selling on Creative Fabrica? Did you get an approval on that? Or if you have any difficulty in getting an approval, let me know in the comment section below, guys. I'm going to make another video for you talking more about the Creative Fabrica and how to upload an ad and various things regarding it. So that's it for today's video guys. I hope you really enjoyed it. See you for the next time guys. Take care. Bye guys.